Hi guys, Nathan back finally with a jank dirt. Got a second with it at locals at the weekend. It's a cool deck to play, pick it up, have some fun. I'll just get straight into it. Uh, so we are playing like a Chaos Light Sworn deck. It's like more of a pile, but we're starting off with three Radiant. It's quite a, sh a strong normal summon, it's a tuner. So on summon it mills two, end face it mills two. The end face kind of irrelevant because you are going to be like linking it off or synchro summoning it off. But the main part of the deck is legit just to mill cards. And because you're milling cards, you got to play like the Saki Light Swarms, three Wolf and the Felice. So Wolf, when it's sent from deck to grave, it special summons itself. When Felice is sent from deck to grave by a monster effect, it summons itself. Also has a cool interaction for when going second. You contribute it to pop on the field, then mill three, so it mills more cards. But this one's also a tuner as well, so it helps extend as well. Um, the Shit Light Swarm is three Lumina. Hate this card. Every time I try to combo with it, I had a, like a Raiding Grave and I pitched a summon. It always had the Raiding Crowed which isn't great, I'm really debating to cut it, but I just wanted to give you the list I played where I got second, but this is one card I would probably definitely cut. Um, I'll probably test with it a bit more and maybe give you a bit of an update later on just to see where I've gone with the deck and stuff I've cut, because it was only testing. Um, another broken engine is the danger cards. So I'm playing quite a big danger package. Nessie, um, well, they all have an effect where they all draw a card, but like, if they're discarded, Nessie's a rotor for any of the other dangers. Mothman's a um, discard, a draw one and discard one. Snake, when it's discarded, summons itself, which is like the worst one of them all, but it's still a good danger to have because it's also a different type for uh, Curious. Jackalow, when it's discarded, it summons a danger from deck. Uh, Bigfoot pops a face up card and the Thunderbird is popping a face down card. These are good because they're level 8 um, and they have the good utility for going second. Uh, Mothman's really good because it is a level 4. Nessie's good because it is the rotor so it searches all the other dangers. And the fact it's a 7, there's neat interactions where you can summon it and like you can get a, a level 3 tuner on board so you can make Baron before you go into your outlines or into another line that you've got which gives you a protection. Uh, so that's it for the dangers. They're really good. They all say draw one. Like, why wouldn't you play them? Uh, a mini punk package uh, g gives access to Chaos Ruler, just off an E or just the Zarmin and a discard. Um, I'm only playing one of each because you don't want to have too many and have them clogged up in your hand. But if you draw like one of these, it's fine. You search the other and then you use the Deer Note and pitch the Foxy, summon it. There's your Chaos Ruler line, and then you should res this as a tuner extender. You can res this because it's a level 8 as well, which gives you access to a rank 8 play. Um, I did play the Zombie Vampire, the rank 8, which mills 4, but I did cut it because it wasn't coming up. I wanted the outline more times than not. Um, the other cards is 3 Gamma and a Driver. This is also another target for E-Telly, so I'm playing 4 E-Telly targets. So even if I do draw the Zarmin, it's not dead because any level 8 plus the Gamma also makes Baron. So like you can make your Chaos Ruler stuff, E-Telly summon Gamma and then make Baron and then all you need is to have one Tuner Extender and you still got your outlines, so you still have like the protection to combo on. Um, it's a level 2 where it can come up with other stuff um, but that's very very rare. Um, it's a good hand trap as well. A lot of people are on D-Shifter at the minute. Like my Flunder matchup, the guy went uh, game one, t uh, turn one, because I lost the dice roll. He went activate D shifter. I had to gamma it, otherwise I couldn't play. But apart from that, like it is a solid hand trap as well. Um, there's nothing really much more to say about it. Uh, other cool cards is get to play with dragon cards. So three safer, one of each of the baby chaos dragons. This can have that levy if you mill it off curious or just mill it by milling cards. Um, also searches these as well, or you can search the levy if you have two level 4 dragons, but that very rarely comes up. It's also another good normal summon, so it gives you more of a percentage to open up a good normal summon as well. Um, to follow up with the dragon stuff, I'm playing the one levy, and the one like kind of dragon card, but isn't a dragon card, it's the Chaos Creator. This can be searched off Chaos Space, and it is a really good extender. Uh, last dragon card, Destrudo, this card's broken. Um, this. Um, if you target a level 4, you can lower it by 4, summon it, and use it plus a Nessie to make a Baron as well. It also um, gets put back to the bottom of the deck, so you can reuse it on the following turns. So if you do have your boards like semi-cracked, you've got like a crack back to carry on playing. 
Uh, that's it for the dragon stuff. Best reason to play the deck is one snow. This card's broken. Probably shouldn't have come back. I love this card. I played Light Swarm back in 2017 with all like, the grass stuff. I love this card. Glad it's back, but it probably shouldn't be legal. Be banned in a week. No, it's not getting banned in a week, Steve. Um, one Zephyros is a level four, bounces back the danger so you can reuse your dangers. And um, it gives you another way to get into Curious because it's a wing beast and you don't play many wing beasts. It's legit this and the Thunderbird. And then the last one, another broken card, is Jet Synchron. This probably shouldn't have come back either, but it's another cool card you can play with. Um, this plus the Chaos Ruler can give you access to the Hot Red Dragon Archery in the Abyss, which I do drop on the board 90% of the time. Um, that's it for the monsters. Uh, power spells, three telly. Access to the Armin, Gamma, Broken. Three Chaos Space. This lets you rotor for the baby dragons or levy, gives you a draw, another broken spell. Three charge, mills three for costs and then adds a lights one. You're just going to be adding the raiding, so this card on its own mills five. Another broken spell. Three solar recharge. You're playing a fair few light swarms and like during your mid combo, if you have a light swarm in hand with this, you get to draw two dis uh, and then mill two. Just by discarding the light swarm, it's just another broken card, lets your deck thin, builds your grave up. Like, basically, all your spells, and the last one's foolish, it's just all broken spells which do stuff. The only one that's probably going to be dead sometimes is the recharge, burp up. It doesn't happen all the time. Most of the time, you are legit just trying to dump everything into your grave, and then you just play with your grave. And that's it for the main deck. It is a janky 50 cards. I didn't really have an issue with it. I'd like to cut cards to make it a small account. Like, I might cut the gammas, but a lot of people are on D Shifter, so I don't really want to cut it. It's also another good e telly target, but I believe I am going to cut the Luminous because that card was just atrocious. Um, move on to Extra Deck. Chaos Ruler. It says Extra Deck, top five, add a light of dark. Reborns itself, and it's a level eight. So it's just really broken for the deck. One Omega. You can make this sometimes, or you can make the Savage Dragon. If you Gamma on your own turn, you can use a Maker and a Mega Loop card. So they're starting, like when you're starting to combo, they're on three cards. Like Levy can loop another card and stuff. It's just really broken. There was one game I hand looped for four because I Gamma did my own turn. So negate and destroy the hand trap. I then I Mega Looped a card. I Levy lip, ripped a card. And then I uh, got access to Chaos Creator, and I Chaos Created something back to the Omega and looped another card out the hand. And I dropped Appaloosa Hot Red with a Dweller, and they just couldn't win. Like, that board was just really broken. Uh, this deck's really good for making Dweller as well, which is really good against the Tier Element matchup, which I did play, and I did absolutely demolish them. Um, but, like, most decks at the minute are, like, playing Danger stuff again, and does have Graveyard Reliant stuff, which is good for this deck because you can drop the Dweller, but it just means you have to like hard open Gamma sometimes just so you can negate their Dweller if they try to Dweller you. Um, the level 9 Synchro is hot red. I do drop this a lot of the time because Hulk summons Jet. You're usually getting access to this via two level 4s or the Punk package. So it's another big body which is negating the spell trap which is just really good. One thing I do want to test is playing like a D barrier, a solemn judgment or something. So I can curious dump it, make Griffin to set it. And if I can link the Griffin off, I can just drop this and then I can negate Dark Ruler no more, which is a little bit of a problem for the deck. But it's kind of awkward because you can drop Dweller in its tier element and that could just pass their turn. And if they Dark Ruler you, you still have that point of they can't use their grave so their deck just doesn't function for that turn and if they're not breaking your ball you're just doing it again next turn so they can't play uh last synchro baron this card's broken popping cards um shame it's like a once on field negate uh pop sorry but it's just a broken card you're making this so much it's just so worth just to have uh links striker dragon for the baby dragons IP, you can drop this on the end board, it doesn't come up too often, but you can IP into Unicorn or IP into Appaloosa. I don't really IP into Appaloosa because I'm making it so much, but it's just if you get hand trapped to Oblivion, you can drop this, have Snow Engrave or something, so you have a bit of a board presence. And if you can climb into the Appaloosa, that could be enough for game. 
One Hulk, this card's broken, should probably be banned. Um, gets access to Jet. Unicorn, this card's really good. Uh, just putting back cards, uh, just cracking the boards. Um, one Curious, broken, should probably be banned as well. The fact it says Foolish Burial, then Mill 3, which is just helping your deck so much. And it's just so easy to summon as well because of the danger cards. And then the last link is Appaloosa. Um, I'm not playing Access Code, so I don't own one. But there is one slot where the Zombie Vampire was, and I don't know what to play. And I'll get onto it when I move to it in a sec. Uh, moving on to XYZ. Uh, one Levier, it come up once. Uh, just wasn't good at all. Really wanted to cut it. Uh, I could play Michael the Light Sworn, the level 7 Synchro, Dingir Suit, or Access Code. These are my three options I'm thinking of playing. I'm probably going to play Ding because that helps break boards. Um, but apart from that, it was just really bad. I wouldn't play this at all. One Dweller, broken, should probably be banned. Uh, one Minerva, love this card. Signed by the main man, JY. I still have it after four years when he signed it. I, I just loved playing Light Swarm back then. I love it again now. And the last one in x is number 38. So it's a spell negate. So it's good against like the Runic matchup as well. Um, it's not very really much more to be said. I kind of want to play a Ding as like a second rank 8. But there's not much I'd want to change. I'd just love to play in the deck. Stay tuned. There should be like a combo tutorial or like live replays. We'll just see what happens. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. I'll reply to them when I see them and when I can reply. Thank you. Goodbye.